I'm April. I'm Matt. We've been together about 16 years. We've been married for 11 years. We met um, at, at work. We've been together ever since. So I worked at Whirlpool and I worked on an assembly line and this kid named Justin was fairly new, worked across from me and uh, we started talking one day and he was telling me about he belonged to a youth group and talking about a youth pastor and all these great things and uh, it opened a whole conversation about church and I had told him that my husband and I were talking about uh, starting to join a church and he told us they were building uh, a Grace in Tiffin. We started coming to Grace regularly uh, in January of 2020. My father had just passed away like December 27th. Uh, for me there was like this this huge loss in my life and I was looking for comfort and she'd been talking about somebody she worked with. He was kind of pointing us towards Grace and, and that's when we started coming. I came in, met with AJ and kind of we had a little conversation and he said, do you want to turn your life over to Christ? I said, absolutely. And and, I, and we turned it over. It's all you. Come into my life, take it over, do whatever it is you need to do with me, put me where you need me to be. When I came here, I felt welcome. I didn't I didn't feel broken anymore, and that, that started really right away. It's just really neat to listen to the stories in the Bible and to read about them and to learn about them, because I knew nothing. My experience with the Bible was very minuscule. I'm meeting with, with Pastor AJ and sitting down, and I told him my story. I didn't get into great detail. He asked me if I was ready to give my life to Christ. We said the sinner's prayer and we prayed together. For me, I know I don't have to do this alone. I have Christ with me. There's a peacefulness about that, even when I'm screwing it up every day and I'm not getting it right. There's, there's a peaceful side to this. I accept the teachings of the Bible. I accept what I learned here and I try to apply it to my life. And it's not always about acquisition of knowledge. It's about application. How do, how do I use this stuff in my daily life? And what the Bible teaches me what was good 2,000 years ago still translates today. You know, those teachings and those moral convictions. I, I make mistakes all the time. There's conviction in my heart. You know, I feel it tugging on me and I, I try to set that right. But now I have an ace in the hole. I have Christ in my life, right? I didn't have that before. There's hope for you out there. Um, I found it by coming to Christ. I found it by coming to grace. Um, I found a better way to live. The journey's in the ride. So buckle up, right?